What, uh, you know, in terms of these documents, sticks out the most to you thus far? I think what you see is a Clinton operation, particularly their strategy for how to identify members of Congress, how to court members of Congress, and particularly using Hillary Clinton uh, trying to get that health care legislation done in 1993 and 1994, how she went about lobbying members of Congress. I think uh, you get a real peek inside the uh, Clinton operation at that time, uh, like the book, which has a more recent peek inside how they, how they work and how they go after other politicians. Okay, so let's let's get to that because uh, I've got a memo here uh, that, that came from these documents. It was a, a memo sent by Steve Ruschetti and Chris Jennings to others in the Clinton administration and they write, quote, we have begun a file on every member. The files, which can be cross-tabulated, include a wide array of information on the members added to these files will be information uh, and research being obtained by the DNC and intergovernmental Affairs uh, Office, you know that is, Tell us the significance of this. Uh, you specifically have pointed to this as being uh, something uh, to reference. Sure, I think there are a lot of people that would be uncomfortable with the idea that the White House is uh, integrating the work of uh, the Health and Human Services Department, the Office of Intergovernmental Affairs, which are taxpayer organizations, with that of the Democratic National Committee, the party's national arm, uh, using both of them to figure out how to work on lawmakers. The DNC's role, obviously, one of mm -hmm. fundraising and helping win elections. Uh, that's not usually something that the public likes to see hey, going on within the White House. Yeah, so and Jonathan, I we're in this time of, of a lot of security concerns, you know, certainly surrounding the NSA and just how much information do they know about all of us. Um, so with this information coming to light, is this going to be a problem for her in 2016? I don't think keeping track of the members in particular is a problem for her. I mean, you know, the computer systems they had back then were like Commodore 64s, uh, not exactly the, the NSA database right now. Uh, but I do think that people will look at how they operate, how they work people, uh, how she works people, as uh, part of the, the idea of how, how would she make decisions and how does she govern. Mm -hmm. Is she running in 2016? Oh, I think so. For sure. 99.99. All right, we're going to 99.99%. 99.99%.